in tonight. And as you can see, Roman. What are you? A firefighter. Do, are you pretty sad that you're a firefighter? What yes. are you? I'm happy. You're happy? Show me your super excited face. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a good one. So, we've had um, a couple of Roman's friends send him some firefighter outfits. This is the second one that we got today. So he's gonna wear this out today. Um, the other one's really cool too, but we're gonna uh, we're gonna see how he goes with this. We actually have a different costume that we got him for actual Halloween, but he is obsessed with these firefighter costumes. So he will be using these long after Halloween, I guarantee it. And Gracie, come here, let me show you. And Gracie, what are you? Unicorn. And you even got unicorn shoes that squeak. Here, and what are you? Flash. He's the Flash. Super cool. Ah! Roman's super cool. Are you excited? Ah! Roman's an evil fighter. We're going to go trick or treating at the retirement home tonight. Roman's and you guys are going to come with us. We'll Roman's see you soon. So, we are on our way to Santa Marta Retirement Community. With. The crazies. Firefighter Roman, Unicorn Gracie, and the Flash. You're an evil firefighter? Yes. Oh. And, and Daddy, let me tell you something. Well, um, um, there's yellow things you can only see at night when. You can only see those yellow things at night on firefighters. It's true. That's true. They're called reflectors. Yeah, like when a light shines on it, it's really bright. So people don't run you over. Light shines bright. Everywhere, Everywhere we go. All right. Gracie, what are we doing? Guys, shake a CD. Really? Roman, what are we going to get when we say, what do I we say when we knock flash. on the door? Shake a tea. And then what do they do? They open the door. <laughs> that's, that's right. They probably doors already open. Lit, you going to wear that? That's good stuff. All right, so we are at the San Marta Community Center with my Spina Bifida community. And, um, then there's some trick or treat. We have the uniform. Smells really good. Really nice facility. So, this is our crew. That's what we're doing. So, we're going to go behind her. Hi kids. <laughs> Can you tell them what you are? What are you? I'm a firefighter. He'll talk. A unicorn. A unicorn. A unicorn. This is Superman. And what's Superman. daddy? Hi. Superman. Superman. <laughs> and mommy's always a princess. Yeah. Oh boy. Fireman. Yeah. Look at your ladder. Like climb up the ladder. Oh. Do you know how to climb up the ladder? Good job, Fireman Roman. Hey, Gracie, put your hood on. No one's going to know what you are. They just look like a girl in her pajamas. I want my bag. Okay. Your Mickey Mouse? That will Mickey Mouse. No, it, your bag is Mickey Mouse. It's a Mickey Mouse pumpkin. It's a pumpkin. It's a Mickey Mouse pumpkin.
just finished up the trick or treating at the assisted living nursing home. Yeah. I think it's all retirement of it. community. Retirement community. That was a really nice place. It was super super snazzy. Super and as you can tell, all the kids are happy because they're mowing down candy before dinner. Did you guys like that? Yeah. You guys know that it really makes those people happy to see you guys. They probably it really makes might, their might not whole even day. Seen kids for a long time. It probably reminds them of when their kids were little. Do you know that? Well, I would imagine so. Do you think any of those people had babies or young kids? I don't think so. So anyways, um, yeah, it was a lot of fun and it's always good to hang out with other families who understand our lifestyle. And, and plus it's good for Roman to walk around there and see all those other kids in wheelchairs. I mean, that you can just see he was kind of excited about it. Plus it brings up the discussion with our other kids. Gracie asked, asked today if we all have spina bifida. So good question to go over that we don't. Um, but it's nice to, to keep, keep around other people with. yeah I think it's really good for Roman to be around other people with spina bifida just so that he grows up knowing that he's not alone and that there are lots of other people in this world that have spina bifida and we don't ever want him to feel alone or secluded and I think just having him grow up and with that um, is really going to help his outcome later so yeah um, we have another Halloween event next Friday, which should be a lot of fun. Um, it's again another spina bifida event. Um, <laughs> you're done. I would hope so. You idea. ate almost your entire bag. Okay. All right. So yeah. See you guys later.